300 pounds. This is a lot of weight for you to try to stop, you see? And you're wasting a lot of energy more than me. So here, go. So this your defense here is not bad, but I'm wasting so much energy I'm getting an advantage because I'm so light. But if you're very strong here, go. And I try to stay here, go. It's just gonna be a matter of time before I die. So go again. My weight is all here in your shoulder. And that stops you from being able to come up. Now I'm going to trap your wrist, your hip, and buckle your knee here. Okay. So all the weight is here. I'm going to trap the hip here so that you can't walk with me. Look, look, stay still, stay still. If I come around here, follow me, follow me. So I put the hand on the hip so that you can't follow me, and I buckle the knee here. The weight is here on the shoulder. I'm going to put the knee down. Take a hold. I'm going to put it here. I'm going to put my hand on the hip. Bring my head in like that. Wait, stop. You're not focused on this. You focus on just bringing your hand down here. Bring your weight down. Like this, look. Like you're hanging on me. Yeah. Look, look. You're just pulling me down. Hold my neck. You're just trying to do this. What I do is I grab deep and I just hang here. See? Okay. Again. Yes. Good. Now the hand goes on the hip and go to the side. Yes. Now this hand here. Over the other hand goes on my hip. Here or here? This hand goes on this hip so I don't turn. Okay. And then. Yes. Alright, guys, let's try it. Okay, we're here with the Gracie himself, Cron. Nice to meet you, Cron. How's it going? Thank you very much for letting us join in. Oh, thank you very for coming. enjoyable. Thank, thank you for coming. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. So, how long have you been here? Um, I think six years. Was you born in Brazil? Yeah. Oh, I've been. I was been here at this academy. Been here in LA since I was one. Since one, ah. Yeah. Because oh, I noticed your accent. It's a little bit LA, a little <laughs> bit Brazilian. A little bit. Yeah. I speak better English than I do Portuguese. Cool. And uh, how long have you had your black belt? You're quite new, yeah? Like a month. Wow. Is it good? Does it feel good? Yeah, it feels good. It feels good. <laughs> so uh, how, long have, um, how long have you been training? Um, ever since I can remember, I've always had it. Yeah. Been around jiu-jitsu, training with the gi, training with my How dad. old are you? 19. 19, wow. Jeez, I feel 
very humbled. I'm 32 years young, <laughs> and you make me like a baby, you know. Yeah. Um, you enjoy teaching? Yeah, I really enjoy teaching. I think um, teaching for me is, is everything, you know. That's one of the main reasons I train, and I feel like when I teach Jiu-Jitsu, I'm um, spreading the technique that I've you know. Have you always wanted to teach? Um, or did, is when you were growing up, I want to be like my dad, I want to be a fighter, or I want to teach jiu-jitsu? Yeah, I always wanted to, to teach jiu-jitsu, to be a fighter, to train, to compete. You've been doing very well in competition lately with the brown belts and everything. Um, have you any aspirations to fight MMA? And if so, can we look out for you soon, or are you biding your time? Um, yeah, I'm not going to do MMA right now, but definitely in the future. But not for, for a while. I okay. want to get... I have a lot to learn still in jiu-jitsu, you know, yeah, still have a lot yeah. to compete. But you're still, you've, if you wanted to do MMA, you've got a, a very high pedigree and all the right people around you to look after you. Yeah, yeah, but I'm still very young and I still need to learn a lot more before I step into sure. that field.